Hey guys, and today we are going to install dot .mod for cold waters. So for the prerequisites, you need version 1.15g of cold waters downloaded from Steam. And of course, it has to be a vanilla installation because mods are usually not cross-compatible. You're going to go to this GitHub page where the mod is hosted. There's also a Google Drive link as well, and I'll have both of those linked in the description. We're going to go to the release tab now, and we're going to click the .mod version 0.1 beta. I'm going to download this zip file, and we shall wait until uh, it's finished downloading. Now I'm going to open this file here, and I'm going to open this again by double clicking, and I'm going to pull up another window where my cold water installation folder is. And it's already like this because I've had a previous version of .mod installed. So I'm going to copy these files in JSGME folder here. And I'm going to um, run this new installation application, which is .mod installer.exe. And you're going to get um, this because this mod is obviously this is a thing with fan games and some other pretty obscure apps, but it's harmless. So we're gonna enter that. We're gonna press Y here once this um, app is open. Then we're gonna press enter. And of course it's downloaded for the GitHub page. Just keep, press enter. And we'll wait until this uh, is finished. Um, JSGME is already installed and I'm also updating, but if the, this isn't a problem because He'll install basically the same way if I am uh, making uh, it from a new installation. Then I'm going to activate JSGME. And you can see the .mod is already activated because I already have .mod installed. But to show you how the actual installation process works, I will remove this. And I will put it back here to the activated mods. And that's uh, pretty good. So we can close this now. And don't worry if the um, dot mod and override change the default folder from the vanilla installation. It's not a problem. And I'm going to open the game right now to show you what you're going to see when you launch a game with dot mod. Now we have this new loading screen here and has cold waters with subtitle dot mod. And you'll see the uh, script version and the version of the mod on the bottom right here. And we'll show, I'll show you the rewritten options UI. So you finally confirmed that dot .mod is installed and working. Congratulations. And that's how you install dot .mod. See you all later.